So in, in Balanced View, we're given the opportunity to look to our direct experience and to look at our experience of, of daily life and, and what occurs in daily life. And all that we experience, we simply term in Balanced View, data. That's thoughts and emotions and sensations, all other experiences can be neatly nested under this title, data. And you may have heard the term open intelligence. Did anyone hear that word? Those words? <laughs> and what open intelligence is, 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 is mind. Synonymous with mind. And our minds are actually relaxed and, and totally alert at all times. Open, clear and spacious like, like blue sky. Short moments, repeated many times of open intelligence <laughs> is an opportunity to, to touch in with that and to check out our own experience of open intelligence, our minds being open and expansive like clear blue sky. So right now, test it in your experience, just, just test it out. There might be these descriptions ap appearing, car carrying on, ceasing. But what I see in my experience when I rely on open intelligence is that naturally they arise and they, they fall and disappear like that bird flying through the sky. The flight path of the bird, it leaves no trace. And just the same, we can see how all of our thoughts and emotions are like this. Thoughts and emotions and sensations. And when I heard that, that was quite uh, remarkable. When I heard that actually, I, I thought that, wow, that's something that I'm not going to forget. That's something that, uh, that's something that I can use in my day-to-day -day life. That's something that really I see would be of benefit to myself. And so I went and, and checked it out more. I checked it out in my experience more. Now there were many things that I really wanted to control in my life. Um, that I really, really wanted to get, get down and get sorted. Um, I saw that there was, you know, there were many people doing all sorts of things and I would have loved to, to, to uh, control their responses, their reactions and, and what they think and say and, and do about me. But I saw that I couldn't even control my own thoughts and emotions and sensations, so how the hell was I going to control anyone else's? And, and there was just all of this uh, seeming cacophony of, of data going on in my experience. One experience I could say was, was sleep. That was something that I really, really wanted to control. I really, really wanted to, to get to sleep on time. <laughs> and I really, really wanted to get at least eight hours of sleep. That was, um, yeah, that was definitely something that I wanted. And if I didn't get that eight hours of sleep, then people should you know, be wary because I'll be a little bit grumpy and my experience the next day might not be, be uh, so optimal. And so why I'm sharing this with you is because it's a practical experience where I found great benefit quite immediately actually. So like um, when I would go to sleep at night I would just listen to the Four Mainstays and there was an immediate sense of our mi my mind our minds being relaxed and alert and, and, and expansive. And that was, that was deeply soothing for me because no longer was I running those tapes of more money. How am I going to get that money tomorrow? What am I going to say to that person? Um, what are they going to be saying about me? No longer was I running those those tapes, they were just allowed to be as they were. All of these sorts and emotions and sensations can just be allowed to be as they are. Actually try to do otherwise. <laughs> right now. <laughs> try to get in there and change them and manipulate them. If we're open and available to open intelligence, we can confess that actually everything is as it is right now, right? I was like, okay, yeah, uh, I have to admit, everything is as it is, right? <laughs> I can actually allow everything to be as it is. 
so there's that opportunity right there, you, you know, there's a choice to either, no, uh, I'm, I'm not going to allow everything to be as it is and I'm going to refuse that that's the case and to continue on with those elaborations and descriptions with whatever comes up in your life, whatever is arising, whatever thoughts and emotions, sensations, whatever people are saying to you, whatever um, other people are, are doing, we can continue to elaborate that or we can stand clear, powerful, alert and relaxed in open intelligence. So that's the choice in each and every moment. It's quite simple. It's quite simple. And there's a structure to, to, to ensure that you are supported in each and every moment to take that choice. And it was quite a unique structure for me, a unique support structure that I'd never before come across. Because I'd been hearing about this, um, hearing about the, the, the power that comes from allowing everything to be as it is, but as soon as I stopped hearing about it, then I just totally forgot and um, was off on my merry way. Doing the same old things again and again and expecting some different results to occur for me. But here in the Balanced View Training, there is a comprehensive support, <coughs> a comprehensive support structure <coughs> that brings open intelligence into everyday life experiences like going to sleep at night, like relating to our loved ones, our family, our friends. Um, whereas before I thought, uh, okay, I'm just going to have to, I'm just going to have to leave. <laughs> I'm, everything is just too much for me. I know no, no solutions for this. I'm just going to have to try to manipulate my circumstances in some way just to get out of this all. And, and so that was, it's quite distressing when we just place such emphasis on trying to rearrange parts of the sky. Right? Trying to rearrange these, this, this flow of thoughts and emotions and sensations. And so once I found this relief in my experience, I also wanted to share it. And I, I also wanted to share my experience and I was also quite reluctant to do that because I saw all around people that were powerful standing up and being subject to criticism, being subject to sarcastic remarks. Uh, I saw all of that and to share something that is so radical like peace, total peace, total stability, total harmonious relationships in each and every moment in each and every moment where my relationships from day to day are only becoming more and more empowered this can be quite nervous for some people to hear right this can be quite <coughs> radical for some people to hear and so I, what i have seen people go on in their merry little way and uh and relate in the way that they do, sometimes through sarcasm, sometimes through criticism, sometimes through blame, judgment, gossip, all of these popular ways to, to find that little bit of um, comfort, that little bit, bit of uh, connection, that connectivity. You know, I can relate to that. I can very much relate to wanting to find uh, deep, connection with everyone, uh, wanting to be liked and wanting to be loved in each and every moment. And where I found the solution to that, where I found that was not in any of these, these ways, these old ways of relating, these really primitive ways of relating and these really painful ways of relating. And what I found was that my deep connection with everyone and everything was not about in about emphasizing my lack of um, <clears throat> my lack of being connected with people. It was about seeing that even if uh, those thoughts and emotions come up, those sensations, those vulnerable sensations like maybe 
there's 80 people looking at me right now. Um, vulnerable sensations like maybe I, I, I'm the only one feeling these things. Maybe I'm the only one and everyone else is having a great time and, and I don't know what open intelligence is. Does that sound familiar? Maybe uh, I'm the only one left out and everyone else is is having a great time and I'm the only one that wanna, wants to wants to watch a film or <laughs> you know do something um, get a massage um, go and eat at a nice restaurant all of these data we have to see that we're, we're not alone with these data streams the, I, I've seen this in my experience that we come this is the power of community we come here and we say these questions and everyone can relate I can relate to those questions, I have them and had them. And, and so this is the, the power of this, the Four Mainstays really, the power of the community, to deeply normalize all data, all data, nothing excluded, so all data is inseparable from open intelligence and simply is a reminder to, to rely on open intelligence. It's simply a reminder that we are naturally in, and inherently powerful no matter what's going on. And so now I really love those opportunities to, to speak up. And I see the louder that I speak up, sure, there, there are some loud uh, responses back or, or those responses. No, but I really, really want these, this data to, to exist. To, to, I really, really want this, this data to, um, to have some independent nature. That's a better way of putting it. And so the, the louder that we are allowing everything to be as it is, then there, I've seen that there's even more an opportunity to be in touch with the mainstays. That that's what they're there for. To just really, really support that uh, expansion into our, our beneficial potency. <coughs>